groovy handmade card is a fun way to send a, a card to one of your 1960 friends or any of your friends that might be want to be a hippie. This adorable card is made with close to my heart cardstock, close to my heart embellishments, and an image cut from the Feeling Groovy cartridge from Cricut. The Feeling Groovy cartridge was available this past week from Cricut. Uh, it was, you could get it for free, but it was only good for a few days. Each Friday, Cricut offers a free Cricut cartridge images, and this past week, of course, it was Feeling Groovy. Now don't worry, just in case you miss these images, you can still purchase the cartridge in digital form. Cricut is always offering special promotions, so check my website out for the latest information. The supplies needed for the uh, one groovy card is are just a few and it's very simple. There's a, a, a card base like so, and this card base is five by six and a half. I use the dot, big circle dot, um, for the mat. I used pop-ups in a couple sizes for uh, attaching the flowers. I used uh, scraps of card stock in multiple colors and um, I tried to pick bright colors and a black for the um, the matching image. Again, whatever I had left over, these are just pieces and I used a variety of colors as you will see as we go forward. So the first thing you need to do is have a card base which is five by six and a half. And then you're going to cut a mat from this uh, Sugar Rush Red Circle cardstock from close to my heart. And it's cut at four and three quarters by um, six and a quarter so it fits on here. Then you're simply going to attach um, this mat. So the next thing you do after you have the mat attached is you're going to cut the flower images and the uh, groovy images. You cut one flower image at 1.27 wide by 1.41 high, both in black and a brightly colored image, and then you're going to glue them so they're slightly off center. Then you're going to cut two flower images or I think I actually I cut three flower images um, from brightly colored cardstock and the black and those three images were cut at 1.02 wide by 1.13 high again and I um, attached them off glued them together uh, offset a little bit and the final two flower images were cut from brightly colored cardstock card and black and they are at 0.76 wide by 0.84 high. Again, if you need information on this, I have step-by-step -step tutorial um, in writing on my blog, margaritasmadness.com. And then the final image that I cut from the groovy, feeling groovy cartridge was the groovy image. And again, I cut one in black, one in purple. They're the same size. And those are cut at 2.37 wide by, excuse me, by 1.23 high. And again, I'm going to assemble them slightly off center. I'll be back in a minute. I need to get a little further um, away from the camera so that I can uh, match the uh, images up when I glue them. I'll be right back. So here you can see. I uh, attach the two groovies together, uh, offset a little, along with all the flowers. And then what I did was I put little pop-ups on the back to give the, um, I put one on each flower to give the, um, the, the card a little bit of dimension. So the next thing we're going to do is we're going to attach 
the flowers and the groovy. And it's so simple. All you do is mm -hmm. pick your spot, attach. I started with the large ones. Attach. 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 And attach. So I have all the flowers on and I like I really like the way it looks with all the um, with the pop-ups. It just gives it a little more psychedelic look. And then the final thing I did, I took some sugar rush. These are the uh, gemstones that came in the sugar rush uh, kit. And I took the bigger ones, the little embellishments, and I just put them in the center. Again, it gives it a little bit more of a pop-up look, a psychedelic look. So here you have the pop-ups, um, flowers and the groovy, and then I don't know if you can see it, I added those Sugar Rush gemstones to give it a hint of a sparkle and a more psychedelic look. This card was made in just a matter of minutes. You, you're just cutting um, flower images and a groovy image and making a propping them up on a, on a card in a card base. Um, the most interesting thing is I try to make something every week with the cartridge that uh, Cricut is offering for free. And otherwise, I don't think I ever would have made a groovy card. But you know, I have a friend that lives in the UP of Michigan that would just adore this. So as soon as I get it finished and get the inside written, off it goes up to Michigan. So I thank you for watching my video. I hope you enjoyed it. I have many more to come. Please check out my um, website, margaritasmadness.com, for um, interesting projects and some special offers. Again, thank you for watching, and see you soon.